गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ हीमोग्लोबिन एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो मैक्स पॉरर्स इन 1959 डिस्क्राइब्ड द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ हीमोग्लोबिन हीमोग्लोबिन इज बेसिकली अ प्रोटीन एंड इट इज अ टेट्रामेरिक प्रोटीन दैट मींस it has four subunits so basically it is made up of two subunits of alpha polypeptide chains just like this this is one alpha polypeptide chain this is another alpha polypeptide chain and it has two subunits of beta polypeptide chains so this is one beta polypeptide chain this is another beta polypeptide chain so total it has four subunits hence it is called tetrameric protein each polypeptide chain is linked to a heme prosthetic group so alpha subunit contains 141 amino acids beta subunit contains 146 amino acids so one alpha subunit has 141 amino acid and one beta subunit has 146 amino acids what is that heme so heme basically contains iron in the center of the porphyrin ring now the subunits are bound together by various bonds such as hydrogen bond hydrophobic interactions and salt bridges strong interaction is found between alpha and beta subunits hence on mild treatment with urea hemoglobin partially dissociates but alpha beta dimers remain intact so if you treat that hemoglobin with urea the hemoglobin will be partially dissociated but you will get two alpha beta dimers why since they have very strong interaction infant hemoglobin contains two alpha and two gamma chains these two gamma chains are replaced by beta chains in adult conformations of hemoglobin so it has two states r state and t state oxygen has more affinity to r state deoxyhemoglobin is present in t state so this is all about today's lecture i hope you liked the lecture thank you for watching my video